Here's a quick look at the JST connector that will connect to the uh, circuit um, for the tail lights. Right here I am soldering the positive wire from the JST to the anode on the first LED. Make sure to remember to pre-install your heat shrinks. Here I'm connecting a negative wire not connected to the JST to the first LED uh, because this is going to be a series wired set of lights. So you see that that, uh, that negative wire is did not connected to anything at this point. Here I am soldering a uh, non-connected positive wire to the anode on the second LED and this will be connected uh, to the negative uh, free-floating wire that, uh, that you see there and then I'm going to connect the negative uh, cathode to the negative wire which is connected to the, to the JST connector. Again, very important that you pre-install your heat shrink, otherwise you will have a hard time uh, preventing shorts without uh, using gobs of tape. So now that that is soldered in place, I'm going to connect the negative wire from the first LED to the positive uh, wire on the second LED and I will solder that connection and then cover it with heat shrink. Heat guns work uh, very well for working with heat shrink uh, in order to get a nice tight fit. Um, then I'm going to separate the wires and uh, loop over the uh, negative wire from the first LED and the positive wire from the second LED and then heat shrink those together um, to the JST connector. That way I have two separate uh, sets of wires, one set going to each light. Here you can see me uh, heat shrinking the uh, anode and cathode uh, to protect the uh, system from shorting. And then I'm going to also install a, an extra piece of heat shrink over both to provide some additional support and protect from any rubbing or, or uh, any vibration that uh, may be encountered once they're installed. Here you can see the lights uh, and connected to the system, uh, the battery that I'm using um, will provide power to the coil and the relay causing the lights to dim and once the power is taken away the uh, lights of course brighten up. This is mimicking the uh, action where these uh, two wires are connected to your positive and negative motor leads and this will uh, this is what actually actuates the switch in the relay uh, causing the lights to uh, go to brake light mode or to dim in tail light mode.